Have an update update. An online watchdog group that gained quick notoriety for tracking down alleged sex predators may find themselves in trouble with the law. I gave you a chance, man. You could have kept this private, but you wanted to come out and meet a 14 year old boy for sex. Thousands of you watch this confrontation on 11alive.com. The man in the video, James Cruz, is currently behind bars, charged with ch enticing a child. But the man behind the camera may also face some uh, legal trouble of his own. 11 Alive's Ryan Kruger is here to explain. Ryan? Yeah, John Savior, the man behind these viral videos, says law enforcement has told him to stop making them. Otherwise, he might be charged. Now, what were you here to do with John and I, man? We were going to go hang out. Their first video shocked viewers across the metro. A man calling himself John Savior confronts an alleged child predator in a Griffin Walmart, reminiscent to the long running NBC show To Catch a Predator, which always worked with law enforcement. You're Jeff, right? Yeah. And what are you doing here tonight, Jeff? But there's a difference between the two. Savior never worked with law enforcement, he went to his confrontations alone. I showed the video to attorney Randy Kessler to get his perspective. When you see that video, is there a difference between a private group doing it versus law enforcement doing something similar? Well, 100 percent. I mean, there's a reason we have law enforcement. I mean, I don't want everybody in the world being able to go out and make traffic stops and make and pull people over. On his Facebook page, Savior writes that he will no longer attempt these kinds of confrontations in Henry County. Otherwise, he risks legal trouble himself. I reached out to Henry County Police but never heard back. Why are you here? Just to hang out. The suspect in this video, James Cruz, is still behind bars. But Kessler believes the suspect's lawyers could have some legitimate concerns about how he was arrested. As a lawyer, if I was defending the guy, I'd have to see who was the person that, that caught him. You know, what is his baggage? What's his background? They're trying to do the right thing. But if we go out there and try to act like policemen, we're going to end up in trouble. And Savior writes on social media he is not going to stop, but he will be changing his strategies.